I can. <clears throat> Come on. Hello. 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 Hey, do we send screenshots to your TikTok? Nope. All Facebook. Do not do TikTok. Thank you. Appreciate it. I gotta fix my eyebrow. Ugh. Well, I'm waiting for one person to get in my box and then we can talk. I do not think that this is okay for even one fucking second, dude. No, not you, Karen. No. Well, if you want to get my box, you can, because I texted you. Because I don't think what they did to you is fair either. But you have to speak for yourself, unless you want me to. I don't, I, I'll respect whatever decision you you say. Uh, hold on, y'all. We're waiting for Kaylee. Did you get the Gabby Scooby snack count? Nope. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I really nice. Becky, I, I got your message. I'm, I'm, I, um, I want to come on here and say you are really I'm talking. Nice. I can't hear you. I love watching your TikToks. Well, as long as you guys can, yeah, if you want to report the hate pages, sure. Um, yeah. But make sure you get the name of the account. Gabby, did you hear me? You are really nice. Don't let the haters get to you. I love watching your TikTok. Feel free. I have... Um, Here is Allie admitting to calling. I have a crappy phone. <laughs> What's up, Mayla? What's up, Mayla? And literally, this is his response. Although in poor taste, that is not sexual abuse of an animal. <laughs> what is it, sexual abuse? Well, actually... <laughs> Um, so I, I sent that video a lot. Well, I didn't say it, but I sent that video, but somebody sent a message saying, if you go to the twins Reddit sub, Scissor Sister Drama, you can see two videos of Danny holding up her rose slash, you know, toy to get Enzo to lick it, asking him if he likes it and if it smells good. A lot of us think this may be under sexual abuse of an animal. If she's willing to do that in public, essentially, I'm worried about what she may be doing with that cat behind closed doors, like things like that. So that's why he said that. She's got a few yeah. screws loose. Who, Danny and Gabby? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we figured that out. <laughs> you know who else? You know who honestly might be worse than that?
Okay. That. Thank you for that. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I'm... I don't have a good phone. Are you talking or no? Yeah. I can't hear you. Hold on a second. I can't hear you, Becky. I don't know why. Kaylee? Yeah. You can hear me, right? What? You can hear me, right? Yeah. I don't have a really good phone. Uh, it's crappy. But Gabby is a really nice person. I love watching her TikToks. I love watching her live. She is a really sweet girl. And don't let anyone get to her. Oh, I know. I know. There's a lot going on. A lot. They are. Oh, they, uh, so before we start, though, on um, early when I first got on live, someone said that they were pre-recording. And someone said that like they are harassing me. Do you have that or no? Screen recording of that. You do? No, I, I don't. Who who I was it? I see videos of them uh, screen reporting screen recording Gabby, and I've been seeing fake accounts of like yeah. screen recording no, Gabby. Still rolling. So uh, I blocked several of them. I can uh, go into my people that I block, and I can send you guys them and I can just unblock them and send it to you, Gabby. I'm even dealing with the same thing. Um, eight minutes, dud fan? Oh my god. That's the problem in life. They are threatening. No, I don't see it. I'm at my Facebook. Hold on. It's not you. I'm even going my spam. They said it's Amanda. And Allie's the biggest problem. She's the one. She's a drama starter. I don't know if people around my live, but I had the police here. There's going to be a detective. I can't say too much, but right. you, you know, it's those people. It's, it's three people that really start shit. So that's all I'm going to say. Um, and they, the police said that this is cyberbullying and this is harassment based on all the videos I sent her. I showed her um, CPS threats, um, videos of um, calling CPS. Um, oh, shoot. She wanted me to do something. Okay, I will stay on live. Kaylee, talk about what we just talked about, but I need to call some somebody. For okay. I'll mute myself. Go ahead. Um, okay, so... I don't know who it was. Don't share a match to screen record everything and pile it up. Um, I have no idea who it was, but I got a message from my agency this morning. Well, last night or this morning, I didn't see what time, saying that someone got a hold of them and told them that Aaron is on DRUGSs and other stuff about me. She didn't tell me what about me. But um, I messaged her back just right now, and I said, what did they say about me? And she, and before I ever said this, she said, um, she's like, I love you. You know, you're, you're one of my great uh, creators. So she's like, I'll believe you. I just want to know how you feel about it. So, yeah, people are now, I'm not even going to say the agency anymore. Now I'm afraid to even say it. People are now just spreading fucking <laughs> You know, and now they're getting to our agency. Not only are they posting on Reddit, not only are they, you know, talking on lives, now they're going to our agencies. Yeah, uh, all I gotta say is TikTok needs to do their thing, and they need to stop. TikTok needs to deal with, to the point, people need to stop bullying other people in here, because it's getting sick and tired I literally reported this dude because he literally kept bullying me, literally posted videos about me and everything else. Who's that? And yeah. 
TikTok had enough with it, they literally permanently banned his account and banned him uh, TikToks he was making about me, and he got in trouble. They told him if he did it again, he would be put in jail. Gabby's Gabby's Apple Watch, the reason they know the agency is because I am supposed to, you know, ask, hey, do you guys want agency? I can hook you up with mine, and then they give me their code, and I hook them up with mine. So I have to tell them who it is. But now I'm afraid to even do that because I was on live last night for, you know, four or five hours, and I was getting a lot of people to go to my agency. But now I don't know what the hell, like, where the hell they came up with the fact of Aaron doing that. And I don't even know what they said about me yet. Aaron. So, I mean, it's it's ridiculous. It yeah, needs to stop. Yeah, they shouldn't be talking crap about him, Gabby, or Cam. And Cam's a really good kid. And yes, not trying to be mean, Gabby. He is autistic. I have a nephew that is autistic, too. And he's a really sweet kid. And... I, I love your kid. He's a really good kid. Hold on. I've got a message for somebody. Somebody just said that somebody is threatening to call CPS. Hold on. But your kid, I'm sorry, but I love your kid. He's happy. He's Perfect. Kid. Thank you for screenshotting that. CPS, can we start a thread with videos evidence of Gabby being a piece of shit mom? I will gladly send all the videos in if we can gather all videos in the comment section. You're not a piece of shit, mom. You're a good mom. Good. Okay, I'm, I, I, I understand that. Yes, you, you all can say I'm a good mom. We all know that. Yeah. And I'm going to be completely, I've dealt, I, listen, I've dealt with this for a, over a year, okay? Yeah. I know it's not about, oh, TikTok, can you just shut them down? No, what really needs to happen, they need to be behind bars. That is the only way they're going to learn their lesson. Guess what? If I can just take Allie down by myself and that's the only person I can get, then everyone else will back the fuck off. Exactly, exactly. If I really have to just focus on one person, God help me, I will. I know, I know. I do not, I want consequences. I want someone in jail. I don't give a shit what the people in here say about it. I am doing it. And I will not stop until I get what I want because enough is enough. I'm sorry, but justice is for me and I will get what I deserve. I don't deserve this. No, you don't. You don't. don't. You don't at all. No, you don't. You're you're a sweet girl. I love you and your sister's life. You guys are funny. You guys make my day. Thank you for saying that. It's just ridiculous, and it is harassment. I don't give a shit what anybody says, and it is cyberbullying. That's, that's what really. Is. That's what the it police is. told me. The police officer in Florida said, "What I, what you just showed me is cyberbullying and harassment." She's taking that to the detective. And I'm, she's I'm telling you right now, I Good. cannot tell you how many times I have reported that alley girl, and nothing, nothing gets done. I go back and I look, and it says, you know, report or however you could look, and it says no violation found or whatever it is. I don't know. I'm 42 years old, and I have seen a lot of things in my life, but the obsession that that woman has with you is so cringy, and it is so weird. I, I mean, I, I don't know if somebody needs to explain this to me because I don't, this is unhealthy. This is disgusting. Uh, the way that she speaks of you, your sister, whatever. But the fact of what she says about your. I have to watch that movie now. Please go do because she is nuts. Absolutely nuts. Okay. Uh, I don't understand. That. Uh, Ignore me. I she needs to be in jail. That she needs to be in jail. Well, with with the 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 allegations that she puts against you that are false. Thank God that now CPS is starting to see that the allegations, and especially if it's over and over and over and over, then they will start putting things together, and then 
cases can be brought against her legally because of it. But putting that aside, that's just one thing. You need to get a restraining order and you can get a restraining order over cyberbullying over the internet to where even if she mentions your name, that you can or she can get in trouble so please look into that in your state because i know in texas they have that here can i do it online um i don't know if i don't know what florida's everything but i just i know i would go in to a police station and file and send it and see if they could send it to a judge ask somebody i don't know the lingo or what to say but explain your situation and tell them that you need some sort of protection order because you don't know who she's trying to send to your house could possibly say something wrong could dox you whatever it is i don't know but or is it the court office the courthouse yeah then i would go to the courthouse and i would explain everything but you definitely can get a um, restraining order for cyberbullying for sure okay in okay. texas can you can can i stop you right there because because you know that you were just cyber bullying her right who taylor cyber are you talking about cyber bullying Allie? yes if you're gonna sit there and talk smack about her why are you gonna tell her to file a hro on her? um i'm not talking that's not smack okay you need to learn the difference between smack and you need to learn the difference between seeing a person who is on live 24 hours a day obsessing over a woman and her family that's not talking smack no what, what it, it is is that taylor don't even waste your time i am done with you honey goodbye don't even waste your time so hang on who else wants to get blocked who else wants to get blocked because i'll do it in two seconds go ahead well i just i just wanted to hop on and tell you that that i've reported her i've seen it i've been a silent uh i'm not giving incorrect info because you can get you can get um a restraining order over cyberbullying look it up so all I got to say is do your research. But anyways, I've seen it many times, her bullying you. And again, it's it's obsession and it's weird. It's cringy. Never seen anything like it. Hey, Taylor, question. What part of Texas are you in? I live in Texas. What ward do you live at? Tell me your town. I am about 45 minutes from Houston. Well, I, I live in Texas. That's where I'm going to tell you I live at. I don't have to tell you where I live and give you an actual minute of where I am. That's weird for you to ask that. Ooh, are you cringy? You're cringy too. Oh my goodness. No, are you on, 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 why are you up here? Are you trying to bash? Because if you are, you'll get kicked out in two seconds. Yeah? Okay. I've kind of been through something okay, bye -bye, similar. Bye-bye. I'm done playing games. I don't care what you got, what you think of me. I have been too nice. I yeah. have been sitting in the back, ignoring it, just letting it go, not starting shit, not fighting, not yelling. I barely stand up for myself. Do you understand that? I barely stand up for myself and for my son. And you know what? I should. But I try not to, I, I try my hardest not to do that. But you know what? Enough's enough hate me lose i'll lose a follower i don't i don't care it's ridiculous it really is and nelson i already told you last night that gabby took you off of the list yeah all you have to do is just go down to your courthouse you look up cyberbullying because it's the same thing as if somebody was or you were needing a restraining order against a person you know i guess how many feet they could be in front of you. Like I said, I, I, I don't know the lingo, but I do know for a fact you can. The use of technology to harass, threaten, embarrass, or target another person, online threats, and mean, aggressive, or rude texts, tweets, Daddy. posts, or messages all count. Um, so does posting personal information, pictures, or videos designated to hurt or embarrass somebody else. That's right. Oh, I, I know too because there's a lot about me too. So yeah, I agree. 
and and it does count because here, here's the thing when when it says cyber bullying that means like i could be somewhere and somebody could be in new york i, I mean it, it's a computer it reaches it it reaches either way you don't have to be in front of that person's face on live i do not bash um ally i do not bash shay i do not do that see i don't even know who shay is really I don't even go into their lives and be and listen to them and screen record them. And then when like it's 12 o'clock, like Shay does every day. Oh my God, did you see what um, Gabby did? And did da, 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 da. I don't do that, not once. If I have to, I will say what I want to say about that person when they are going way too much in that So day. that means you defend yourself. You defend yourself and then, and then you, Right. The minute you see the thing of it is, and that's what people don't understand, is that they could say all of this stuff, but by God, you open your mouth and defend yourself. Shame on you. You're the bully. You're the bad person. You know, so it doesn't matter if you can share your life online. It doesn't matter if you share your life online. It does not matter. What matters is when you go and you bully somebody and that that doesn't just because you share your life online does not give you the right to bully somebody to treat somebody like crap to lie about somebody or to bring children into the mix it, that does not matter that does not give you the right and if you think oh well she says this and this and this well then i can say this well you know you weren't raised right apparently you don't understand okay, me can we talk can we, can we listen to this listen to this and don't get taken down even after the person has been asked to do so in other words if anything that gets posted online and is meant to hurt harass or upset someone else intimidation or mean comments that focus on things like a person's gender religion sexual orientation race or physical differences count as discrimination which is against the law in many states that means the police could get involved and bullies may face serious penalties. Online bullying can be particularly damaging and upsetting because it's usually anonymous or hard to trace. It's also hard to control, and the person being victimized has no idea how many people, or hundreds of people, have seen the messages or posts. People can be tormented nonstop whenever they check their device or computer. Online bullying and harassment can be easier to commit than other acts of bullying because the bully doesn't have to confront their target in person. Exactly. Consequences of cyberbullying. Sometimes, online bullying, like other kinds of bullying, can lead to serious long-lasting problems. The stress of being in a constant state of upset or fear can lead to problems with mood, energy level, sleep, and appetite. It also can make someone feel jumpy, anxious, or sad. If someone is already depressed or anxious, cyberbullying can make things much worse. Students who are cyberbullied can struggle to concentrate in school, which can affect how well they do there. It's not just the person being bullied who gets hurt. The punishment for cyberbullies can be serious. More and more schools and after-school programs are creating systems to respond to cyberbullying. Schools may dismiss bullies from sports teams or suspend them from school. Some types of cyberbullying may violate school codes or even break anti-discrimination or sexual harassment laws. So a bully may face serious legal trouble. Why do people do it? Why would someone be a cyberbully? There are probably as many reasons as there are bullies themselves. Sometimes, what seems like online harassment may be accidental. The impersonal nature of text messages, posts, and other ways of communicating online means it can be hard to figure out if someone is joking or not. Most people know when they're being bullied, though, because bullying involves repeated insults or threats. The people doing the bullying know they've crossed a line. Two, it's not a one-off joke or insult, it's constant harassment and threats that go beyond typical fun teasing or a nasty comment made in anger. What can I do about cyberbullying? Sometimes, people are afraid or not sure if they're being bullied or not. So they don't do anything about it. If you're being bullied, harassed, or teased in a hurtful way, or know someone who is, you don't have to suffer in silence. In fact, you absolutely should report any upsetting texts, 
messages, posts, or emails. Tell someone. Most experts agree. The first thing to do is tell an adult you trust. This is often easier said than done. People who are cyberbullied may feel embarrassed or reluctant to report a bully. Some may hesitate because they're not 100% sure who is doing the bullying. But bullying can get worse, so speak up until you find someone to help. Sometimes the police can track down an anonymous online bully, so it's often worthwhile to report it. Most parents are so concerned about protecting their kids that sometimes they focus on taking major steps to stop the bullying. If you're being bullied and worry about losing your phone or computer privileges, explain your fears to your parents. Let them know how important it is to stay connected, and work with them to figure out a solution that doesn't leave you feeling punished as well as picked on. You may have to do some negotiating on safe phone or computer. I mean, that's pretty much, I mean, you all pretty much kind of know about that. But, like, they, you know, they, they're like, oh, it's freedom of speech. Oh, it's this. Oh, it's that. Honey, you're absolutely wrong. You're, you're wrong. And, and you're looking like an absolute, you know what, because you're not actually speaking facts. Just take, look, whatever you do online that is your business, I, I, again, it doesn't matter what you do. It's still not right to do what people have done to you. Stand up for yourself. People can say what they want to say about me. I really don't care. But stand up for yourself. Don't allow yourself to be bullied. And what's so sad is that there are way more adults that are bullies than there are children. And that's that's so sad. But um, don't d go to your courthouse. Stand up for yourself, do your research, take whatever you have to show them. But um, like I said, all the other people that you're mentioning, I, I don't I don't see that stuff. The only person that I've ever had the encounter of over and over again is that alley girl. So just please take care of that. And I'm pretty because she seems like the biggest bully out of all of them. But again, that's an obsession and it's cringy and it's weird. So weird. But um, take care of yourself, and I didn't mean to just jump in and be like that, but I feel bad for you because no matter, no matter what you say or do, you're still a human being. It, it's just still not right to be said those things about you or your family, your kid especially. Call me all you want, but please leave my children alone. Thanks, Taylor. Let's roast Taylor now, guys. Oh. Oh. I'm wrong. Okay. Get, no, go away. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. 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 You can go after me all you want, but you go after my supporters. Oh, that is when I drop you hard ass court. Okay, guess what? Guess what? Here's what we're going to do. Instead of actually, you know, yelling and screaming on, on TikTok, I am going to get all... Oh. Okay, you know what? We, we, we... This is... Oh, my God. No, I don't like this. I don't approve of this. This is wrong. This is disgusting. Who do you think you are? I no, know. don't tell me, don't tell me to stop screaming because I am not going, I'm going to scream on the top of my lungs until somebody stops. You don't like when I'm screaming? Then get the fuck out of here. I, I don't give a shit. I don't care. I don't care. You know what? You know what? Somebody do something. Somebody do something. Because I, this is not okay. This is not okay. No, I do not need a break. I'm so sick of people doing this to other people. It needs to stop. Yeah. 
pissed off and no she doesn't it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous that you guys sit here and just keep harassing all you know her for over a year. I'm upset and mine just started. Hers has been over a year, you guys. Like come on, when's enough enough? Do I um supporters? Do I Kaylee? Do I do I do this? Please tell me yes or no. Do I? Do I scream? Do I yell? Do I um do I like bash on um, other creators that are bashing me? Do I ignore it? That's another thing I want to say. Everybody says that you bash them, and that like Shay will be like, well, she bashes me every night. That is a lie. That is not true. Gabby does not get on here and start talking about other people. Unless they heard, unless she heard that they were talking about her. And then she says, well, why? Why are they talking about me? I wasn't even talking about them. That's all she says. But I have not heard her in a very long time talk about somebody. It's funny. It's funny how, it's funny how all of the people that are saying yes, you guys are all haters. That, that's funny. That, that, that's hilarious. That, that's hilarious. How is she bashing other people? Let me ask that. You guys are saying, but you can sit here and bash other people. How is she bashing, bashing other people? Oh, yeah, we have to go, we have to go stop right now. Some, something just happened. We have to what? No, right now it's not even safe to comment right now. So no, nobody comment. And if you're wondering about where my eyebrow is, in Christian's live, and I did a dare. So please just drop the eyebrow. It's an eyebrow. It grows back, okay? Let's stop being really dramatic about it, shall we? If you don't like it, if you want to body shame me and make fun of me, do it. I don't, I, whatever, okay? Think whatever you want to think. I'm, I don't mean to yell. I, I don't yell. I don't, I don't, I try my hardest, y'all, not to even give them the day or a time because that's what they want. They want a reaction. I'm going to be honest with you. It's not easy just to sit back, and that's what I've been doing. I have my moments where, just like today, very few moments where I will stand up for myself and I will say enough is enough. Stop. But the one thing I don't think that I agree on is that you guys can come after me, but then you guys go after the supporters. It's not okay. That's not okay. Why? Let me ask you a question. Why? Because they're sticking up for me and you don't like it, right? Listen to me, you guys. But people that support me and the people that get in my box and they say, Gabby, you're a good mom. Gabby, you're a good person. Gabby this, we love you, Gabby. They hate it. Do you hear me? They hate it. And they, 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 they don't like it. You know, it kind of reminds me of, I'm gonna say God and the devil. Let me explain why. When somebody um, asks Jesus to come into your heart, the devil goes, no! Come back to me. Like, not, I mean, not in that way, but like the devil gets so mad because, you know, it's all about, you know, it's God and, you know, they're all about God and they, the devil wants you to sin and the devil wants you to do this and the devil wants you to be bad and the devil wants you to do da da da. It's the same thing like here. Yes, honey. It's the exact, it's, it's the exact same thing is that the trolls do not want the supporters to love me or to support me. And if you do, they are gonna go after you and me harder. And it's, it's, it's frustrating for me just to sit back and let this all happen. I have been letting this happen for almost two years now. The last year, it's getting much worse and it's getting worse and worse and worse because nothing is happening. And I can handle a few, you know, hate or like, you're a bad mom, that's fine. But there's a difference where, it's beyond even just a few videos. It's like body shaming. I mean, it, it's there's to a point where enough's enough and there needs to be consequences for it. That's my problem. And the closer you get to God, the more the devil tries to come in. Exactly. And the trolls hate when I have supporters. They hate when I have, when, they, when you guys talk 
so much like I don't I don't I, I can't explain it. I, I just I just think that okay let, let let me just calm down because What, what I think needs to happen is I think that I need to just focus off this app and do what I can to get these people in trouble. And because yelling's not going to, not is that that's not the answer. Bashing somebody is not the answer. Talking for hours is not the answer. A lot of people, the trolls and the haters, are going to disagree with anything I say. So it's not even worth it. To me, you're, I'm just wasting my breath. I'm wasting my time talking about it because they just don't care. And they're going to okay. see how they see it. So I apologize for yelling. I just don't like when people go after my supporters. It's all about me right now. They hate my fucking guts. And just because Taylor was speaking the truth, they didn't like that. So now what? They're going to go after Taylor? That's wrong. That's wrong. That's not okay. And that's why I got upset. And I'm sorry, but I have every right to be upset about that because that was bullshit. So I'm sorry for yelling. Something, something just needs to be done. I mean, honestly, just something really, really needs to be done. It's, it's ridiculous. It really is. <coughs> I'm getting threatened because I, because my mods were muting people, the haters, and some of the mods told me that they were getting death. Yep. That's not okay. <laughs> That's what happens. It's, it's stupid. It really is. have a screenshot I have so much y'all you have no clue you have no clue again the off I, I, I had the police here and the police said I showed him everything and the police said that this is cyber bullying this is this is harassment now she's she's from Florida she's like she's with the law listen she's going to the state attorneys and she's going to the um uh, detective Thank God I went to Florida because Illinois didn't do fucking shit. Maybe Florida. Maybe this is where it starts. I've never had a police officer say, I'm going to the state attorney and I'm going to, I need, I need you to fill out a statement right now. And then I'm going to bring that. I never had that in Illinois. Illinois, you suck ass. But guess what? This is a different state. And by the way that she was talking to me, something's going to fucking happen. I can just tell it. If it does it, it doesn't. But guess what? She's doing more than Illinois did. And guess what? You're right. Certain states um, have cyberbullying laws. Yep. And the way that she was talking to me and the way that she was saying, we're going to do this, 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 this. And she goes, I'm going to call you by the end of the week. So I'm going to sit back and I'm going to be like, please, dear Jesus, fight my battle for me. I, I, I am. Because some, I, I don't care. Shay goes to jail. Allie goes to jail one person goes to jail then maybe the rest of you will open up your damn eyes because this is not okay this is this is it's it's not and if you think that this is okay and you're laughing behind the scenes and you think this is a joke it's not because you guys have gone real life with me not saying i'm the only creator but you know what? Maybe I'm going to take a stand and do what I need to do. Or maybe a lot of creators just ignore it. But guess what? I don't think you should ignore it. I think you should stand up for yourself and your family and then the person that's getting bullied and you actually do something.
stand up and say something. And guess what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm a tough fucking bitch and a tough mom. And I'm the strongest person that you ever met. For what I've been through the past two years, you have no clue. A lot of people think that, Gabby, how, how are you doing this? And I'm like, you know what? I don't know how I'm doing this. I don't know how I can sit and watch all of this go on about me and my sister. I just don't. Hold on, Cameron, it's here. It's here, hold on. Hold on, honey, it's at the door. Yeah, honey. Here? Oh, the doggy. You want the doggy off? You do? You want the doggy on the couch? Okay, come here, Coco. Come here. Oops. Don't break that. I don't know if I have anything else to say. I really don't. Kaylee, I don't know if you have anything else to say. I'm, I'm done wasting my breath. I really don't. Just, it, it's ridiculous. It just needs to stop. Yeah. It really does. Anyway, I'm going to get off here because I just came on just to talk about Aaron. Um, well, I just so want to say one more thing. Another thing, you guys, is not only are you going after Gabby, going after Danny, going after me, going after others, you are also bringing in CPS, police, our agency. I mean, come on. You don't have to go that far. Like, you want to talk about us, fine, but you don't need to bring children in or, you know, uh, our agency or, like, our families or anything like that. I mean, come on. Let's, let's not speak about this. My mom called me yesterday saying, Gabby, these people are calling me nonstop. They will not stop. They're talking about all of these things. And she's like, is it true? And I'm like, no, mom, it's not. And I showed her proof, and she's like, I'll block them. Stop calling my mother. She is 72 years old. She does not need it. She is, she is, she works 40 hours a week. 40 hours a week. Ask, ask just, just do me a favor. Just, if you want to hurt me, even though I don't think it's okay and it's not okay, but do not come after my mom. Exactly. Stop Texting her. Exactly. They're going to end up doing something that they're going to regret. Like, that's harassment to an elderly. She's 72. You think she deserves that? What kind of people are you? And the things that you have talked about my mom and the things that you said to my mom, that's elderly abuse. What's wrong with you? How can you say that to a 72 year old? Do you honestly have any, co like, do you, is yeah, there any, make, I'm, I'm sorry, sure is there any brain cells? Is make there any sure brain cells in your up. fucking head to think that that's not okay? It's not, my mom works really hard. And the things that I've heard that you guys have said about her and me and Danny, what the fuck? Mommy, it's this. Did this. It's it. And how she raised us. I'm sorry, but my mom raised me so well. I'm not the perfect creator. I'm not the perfect parent. I'm not the perfect person, but I do fucking try. Mommy, Roy, Roy, Roy. Paw Patrol? And, like, this is just not okay. And I don't want to cry, but, like, 
y'all have to stop, which I know you're not going to because it doesn't matter how many times I ask someone to stop. I even had to do assist and a deceased order and you still go. You act like this is a fucking joke. You laugh and you sit there and fucking laugh, but guess what? Until that person does that, is it really funny anymore? Not saying I'm gonna do that, but there are people out there that have done that. So stop. Because it's not okay. You make someone go nuts after all of this happened. Like after what you guys have done to me and Danny. You know, it, it, it drives people to that. Now, my life is more important than anything. And by the grace of God, I pray every single day to help me with that. But it messes up with your mental and your mood and your anxiety and your, your depression. And it makes you a different person when you have this cyberbullying attacking you. Or I'm not, that, that made no sense. But when you are getting attacked on the internet over and over and over again. And it's so fucking bad. What do you think it's going to do to your mental mind? Ask yourself that. I, I really have sat back. And I really haven't done a lot. Because it's like, why am I going to give them a time and day? It's not even worth it. But you guys are the problem. It's not me. It's not Cam. It's nobody. It's it's the people that have the nerve to do what they do on this app to somebody. Especially. It's so fucking messed up. And I'm not even going to get off this app. Why? Because that's what they want. That's what they want. And I'm going to stay strong like I have been. And I'm not going to let them get me off this app because then they win. And that's why during all of this, how strong am I? <laughs> Only if you actually knew. Most people would just hide and get off, even after 70 CPS reports against me. And here I am, still singing, having fun, lifting up other moms, spreading positivity, which I'll still do that. But the hitters do not deserve to see me cry because that's what they want. So I love that they say, well, you should get off the app then. Get off the app. You should put your life on here. But you know what? People can should be able to live their life and be able to get on this app if they want to without being harassed and bullied. Sorry. They should be able to. There's nothing saying don't get on the app or you're definitely going to get harassed and bullied. Like, no. Just leave people alone. I don't get on here and bully anybody. Nobody gets, like, we don't get on here and bully anybody. Why do you guys have to do it to us? For real. You TikTok or to anybody, actually. Yeah, that's what I mean, to anybody. That's what I'm saying. Like, to anybody, everybody that's on Reddit, everybody that's on here getting harassed and bullied. I feel bad for these people. Seriously. Like, the Inquisitor, RIP the Inquisitor, because that... Like, that was sad. That was so sad. That's what cyberbullying does to people. Gabby, you're sitting there with your one eyebrow in the place that your mom, who's working her ass off at 72 years old, is paying for. She paid for everything in that condo. Your son is sitting next to you begging for attention. Get off the app, Gabby. Pay attention to your child. That's all people want you to do is pay attention to your son. You, what have you won? What have you won? Your mom paid for everything. You are 31 years old. You can't even brush your teeth. You have teeth that are decaying from your mouth because you can't brush your teeth. What are you teaching your son? You're teaching him that TikTok is more important. 
Gabby, look in the mirror. You have one eyebrow. Are you going to say that she can't brush her teeth? Um, yeah, I am saying that. Wow, that's that. going far. That is going that. so far. How it's, do you know what she does it's off? It's that. It's that. Yeah. Just like she's not teaching her son personal hygiene by not changing his diaper, by not brushing his hair, by not washing his She teeth, does change his, his diaper and brush Kaylee, his... Kaylee, oh, you need to sit down, girlfriend. You think you are oh, famous don't go on Reddit right what now, to do. Honey? Don't go telling me what to do. I don't hey. think it's just you're coming on here and saying she doesn't brush her teeth. How well, do you know she brushes her teeth? I have How a do you know? I have so How do you things. know? I have so much more I could say. She sits here on TikTok and neglects her son. What kind of mother has 70 CPS calls on her? What kind of mother? Is that a good mom? Hey, while you're at it, you can get my IP address. I can give you my harassed on this app and lies. Let me just stop you right there. Do you want to see text messages? Just saying, hey, I hate you so much that I want your child taken away from you. What does that I think every person who watches you wants Cam to have like to you? Well, I'm speaking. He's so much that they want me dead. Gabby, nobody has one threat into that they want you dead. What people want is for you to take care of your child. That's what they want. And you sit there and you neglect your son. Okay. And you spend well, you know what? You have listen, after 70 reports, look back there. My yes. son is still there. Thanks Shut to Aaron. Thanks to Aaron and thanks to your mom. Do you work? Thanks to your mom. Dad? No, you don't. So listen. If I was neglecting or abusing Cam, he would be gone. You're scary. You're really scary on the app, aren't you? you? Have no fucking clue. Yeah. No, you you're don't. scary. You know what? Enough's enough, bitch. Please. You think you're the perfect mother? I sure am a lot better than you. That's a damn thing. Perfect mother. Hey, Gabby, who paid for that house? No, Gabby. Who paid for that house? Stop. Do you have a job? Do you take care of your child? My platform. You. When was the last time Cam had a bath? When was the last time Cam had a meal? Not perfect, honey. You need to look in the damn mirror and ask yourself this. You know what you need to do? Someone like this. You need to look in the mirror with your one eyebrow and see how good. Out of control. How do oh, heaven's sake? I'm sorry. Does she I'm... know when you bath him? How do these people know? Do they want you to bath him in front of us? I, 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 I can't. Do they like, want you to brush your teeth? Just brush your teeth in front of us? Guess what? Guess what? Where have I been all morning and all afternoon? I literally what just I'm got saying. on live. Exactly. I know. I just got on live. I know. No. I know. On my phone? I know. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I know. Oh my god. I I can't.